Hello everybody! Happy Purim! This is Boaz Fada with the Daily Astrology Forecast for March 22nd, 2016. As you know, Purim is the Jewish Halloween and it starts today. The esoteric and spiritual meanings in the Jewish tradition are different than Halloween. Halloween, as you know, is the Celtic New Year. We're going to talk about that more tomorrow, about the hidden meanings of Purim and Halloween. And you can join us for that. But today we have so many things to talk about. So let's begin. First of all, we have a, the, the moon in Virgo today. Some astrologers see it as void, of course, throughout the day. But it opposes Ceres. It opposes Chiron at around 1300 hours Central European time. That's around 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. This is a day to really pay attention to your relationship with other women in your life. It's a day of sensitivity. It's a day that we could acknowledge the wounds uh, that we carry within ourselves for a long time or people in, in our environment carry in them for a long time. They could resurface so we could have the chance to heal them, to tend to them. This is really a day that it is important for us to be softer, to be more feminine, to, to be more tender in a sense, to listen to our intuition. The moon is on the north node. It's a time that our gut feeling plays a compass in our life. And after that, at around 1900 hours Central European time, that's around 1300 hours Eastern Standard Time, the moon conjuncts Hygieia, the planet, the planet that's in charge, or the, the celestial body that's in charge about uh, uh, our hygiene, our health, and there, there's a connection today, a, a mind-body connection, and we could really see how our moods influence our health, and our health is inf like health is a is is a not a one-dimensional thing. There's the the health of the body. There's the health of our psyche. There's the health of our emotional body as well, and and today they all play a part in and they are interconnected in a much more powerful way than usual. Mercury enters Kazemi for the next 48 hours. Mercury stands in the heart of the sun. This is a time considered by all the astrologers to, to be a time that the star, or I'm sorry, the planet in the center of the sun is, is given the power of the sun behind it. Mercury, the planet of thoughts, of words, of our navigation through life. This is a day that we need to set intentions in. And this corresponds with the fact that tomorrow we're heading to a partial lunar eclipse. It's going to really bring to fruition what started three weeks ago with the solar eclipse. Bring an emotional maturation to the changes that began back then. Eclipses last for a long time, their influence lasts for a long time, but the, the, the change that needed to happen that started three weeks ago gets finalized tomorrow. And again, setting intentions is a good thing during the next 48 hours. Remember, Jupiter is squaring Saturn in the sky. This is not a time to wait for confirmation from outside. It's a time to believe in yourself even though you might be fearful of some things, you might have self-doubts, stop comparing yourself to other people in your lives. Be yourself. It's the best thing you could be. Thank you for listening, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.